Yeah, welcome savages, savage family, and savage maniacs. We're still in Japan, but we are in Osaka. And I'm gonna show you this lovely hotel. Uh, I can't pronounce it. Don't judge me. Uh, this is the name of it. My Yoko City, Osaka. That's the name of the hotel. This is the outside. Right next door is a lovely curry house. It's a 7-Eleven, there's a law center. There's a lot of stuff nearby. So if you're in Osaka and you want to be at a place that has everything nearby, I would highly recommend this. Uh, I am in a lovely corner room that has view of downtown. And that cost me for two nights $325. Uh, they do have other rooms that are cheaper, but I wanted to show you guys what this hotel has to offer. Uh, so this is going to be a, hopefully a quick tour and review. Uh, show you the front desk area. Uh, the front desk area pretty much has um, the check-in, the restaurant. Um, I think that's where they serve the breakfast at. I'm not gonna get breakfast. Uh, it wasn't included in the price. Uh, matter of fact, this is what you're looking at now. Those are the prices. You do get 10% off, uh, but yeah, you can find stuff cheaper. <laughs> Very much cheaper. All right, so this is the second floor. This is the guest room. I'm sorry, not guest room. Front desk area. Yeah, so that's the check-in area right there. Very lovely. Uh, we're gonna come down here. Uh, they do allow you to do laundry as well. Um, the laundry was like anywhere from 300 to uh 600 yen and it's crazy because the laundry and the washer are all in one so you don't need to have any pods or uh detergent liquid i'm not sure if drinks are free uh i'm gonna have to ask that a lot of drinks free coffee and water for the so i take account i don't think the drinks are free but i'm going to ask i would definitely ask because I'm, the reason I'm thinking it's free because they have the cups right here. And you can just come in here and pour whatever you want. But I still bought my own drink. Alright, I'm going to show you the laundry room. Um, I'm actually doing some laundry myself right now. So I'm checking to make sure it's not done yet. There's a smoking area right here. So if you smoke, you can get your smoke on. Bathrooms right there. And right, let's see. We got here in the laundry room. This is the laundry room. Yep, I still got about an hour. <laughs> so I got about an hour before my stuff is done, which is fine. Today is my rest day. I've been walking crazy for like 10 days straight, about 10 miles a day. So my body is definitely needing a rest. Uh, so let's go up to the room, front desk area. Once again, it's front desk area. Oh, they do hold your luggage for you. So if you come early before your check-in time, uh, they have a luggage room for you to uh, put your stuff in and go explore. Uh, watch this, as soon as you tap it, the car and know exactly what floor you need to go to. Then you have to press a button. And we're in floor 14. Uh, I forget the room number. I think I'm in 412, but I'm going to show you guys the room. The room is very lovely. Once again, that's what you're paying for food here. Take away 10% off of that. Not bad, decent, but once again, you can get more bang for your buck just by walking outside the hotel and getting more stuff. 7-Eleven, Lawson, Family Mart, even McDonald's. That's a supermarket that's open 24 hours. Uh, this is the 14th floor. And let's see. Oh, she's still cleaning. Hey, hey. You, yeah, you're done? Mother. 
Okay, I'll come back. Okay. All right, I got the. All right, so we're we're gonna come back. So. Okay. 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 Okay.
I'm gonna take you around. It's kind of chilly today. That's Japan for you. I live in Florida, so I'm not used to chilly weather like this all the time. But yeah, that, <laughs> this thing wraps all the way around. Just look, wraps all the way around. So crazy. Huge buildings. This is just lovely. So this is just one balcony, which is crazy. I didn't know there was two balconies, but this is great. This is lovely. All right, so we're gonna go back inside. Close that door, cause it's kind of chilly. Then I'm gonna show you the second balcony, which I didn't know was a balcony until I pulled these curtains back last night and I was like, oh man. Got me unlocky. So this is the second balcony. Just it's crazy. Yep. It lights up at night so it looks very beautiful at night. I'ma try to get you guys some footage at night so you can see the difference between day and night. But yeah, this is the hotel room. Once again, I can't pronounce it. I'll put it in the description and I'll put it in the title. But once again, for two nights, it was $325. I did book like two months in advance. So if you're trying to get it at that price, because right now, if you try to book last minute, it's like $440. So to get this at $325 is a steal. So. Keep that in mind if you're in Osaka, you want a nice little view of downtown to be around everything. I can't complain, this is very lovely. I'm gonna show you what it looks like at night. Keep watching, thank you. Savage Family and Savage Maniacs, as promised, giving you a view of Osaka at night from the complex. It's just beautiful. A little bit rainy. Check it all out. Definitely worth it. Just a lovely view. Skies are gray. It's just lovely, man. down there beautiful city I would highly recommend visiting Osaka if you can all right guys about to call it a night got a busy day tomorrow it's gonna be lovely though a couple more days here Just enjoying this view is so lovely. Once again, thanks for watching. I'll be back with more videos in Japan while I'm here. Continue to subscribe, continue to like. God bless. Oh yeah, we out.